All right, what's up, you guys? I am here with the Stomping Grounds 2019 pay-per-view DVD review. This is a one-disc set, so yeah, no really any features or anything like that. Just the pay-per-view itself, which ran a little over three hours. But you can see we have the artwork here. You have Roman up front. You have Seth Rollins, Kofi Kingston, Becky Lynch, and Bailey. And then you have the logo. And you actually have the WWE logo inside of a boot, so there you go. But the background just kind of reminds me of like an Armageddon or like a Great American Bash 2008 cover, to be honest. Kind of very reminiscent. So you can see the spine. You have Becky Lynch with the alternate poster artwork. And then you have Kofi. And then just some artwork on the back here. Nothing too special. And, um... The superstars of Raw and SmackDown kick ass and take names at stomping grounds. I think it's the first time I've seen a swear word on the back of a WWE DVD in years. But yeah, 194 minutes, so 3 hours and 14 minutes to be exact. And yeah, you have a pretty cool shot of Seth Rollins in the stage in the background. So opening this up... We do have a Samoa Joe card. Still have not found one of the autograph cards in one of these DVDs. And I'm still looking for someone else to as well, like, just to see that it's actually happening. But then your disc, you just have, like, that mustard yellow coloring there. Nothing too, too special. And, of course, as always, we don't have a match listing or anything, so I'll go over the match listing here myself. So... On the pre-show, we had the Cruiserweight title match, Drew Gulak versus uh, Tony Nese and Akira Tozawa. Triple threat match for the Cruiserweight title. We had Becky Lynch versus Lacey Evans for the Raw Women's title. We had Kevin Owens and Sami Zayn versus The New Day in a tag team match. We have Ricochet versus Samoa Joe for the United States Championship. Daniel Bryan and Rowan versus Heavy Machinery, Otis and Tucker. For the SmackDown Tag Team Championship. And then we had Bailey versus Alexa Bliss, accompanied by Nikki Cross for the SmackDown Women's title. Then we had Roman Reigns versus Drew McIntyre, uh, with Shane McMahon by his side. And then Kofi Kingston versus Dolph Ziggler in the Steel Cage match for the WWE Championship. And then your main event was Seth Rollins versus Baron Corbin. No countout, no DQ. For the Universal Championship with Lacey Evans as your special guest referee. So if you're picking this one up or you already have, be sure to let me know. You know, this pay-per-view was better than it really should have been. Let's be honest. And, you know, I think this will be known for the bad attendance figures more than anything. That'll kind of be its legacy. So... You know, overall, it's an average pay-per-view. You know, it's not bad, though. You know, it kind of exceeded everyone's expectations. So I hope you guys enjoyed. For now, this has been the DVD Freak. Peace out.